In the words of the great philosopher Brandy, she said, almost doesn't count. With the last words on my lips, that I am a revolutionary. Hey, what's going on YouTube? It's your boy Superior and thank you for watching Superior Thinking where we're committed to an intellectual integrity and a moral honesty. And today we're here to talk about Joe Biden and his administration talking about student loan debt and he is extending it for 90 days. I, I mean, as if 90 days is enough to you know, pay $10,000 worth of money. Like, I don't understand why at, at first he said, we are going to, while, while he was running for president, he said, we are going to eliminate at the least $10,000. Now, of course, people, you know, with student loan debt can range from 10,000 to lower, obviously, but it's usually 20, 30, 40 grand, you know, because, for some reason, these colleges want to pay an arm and a leg in a, in a kitchen sink just to get, you know, some education that will only better themselves and America. They want to just take everything that you got. But that's neither here nor there. But Joe Biden, he wants to extend kind of a, a, a postpone of what people owe for 90 more days. Now, of course, a little is better than nothing. And, I, and this is the same you know, kind of democratic tactics that they use is they'll promise something and then give like 10% of it and say, hey, this is all that we could have done. You know what I'm saying? But now that we're getting a little bit smarter, where we are more aware of what's going on, we just call a bunch of bullshit. You know what I'm saying? But here is a clip from Mr. Joe Biden himself, just eager to tell the American people that you got 90 more days. Folks, our economic recovery is the strongest in the world. But I know that because of the pandemic, many borrowers need more time to resume payments. For that reason, my administration is extending the pause on student loans repayments for 90 more days through May 1, 2022. In the meantime, folks should take advantage of the Department of Education's option to make payments easier, like income-based repayments or public service student loan forgiveness program. Now, like I said, 90 days is more than nothing. You know what I'm saying? And once again, I don't have student loan debt. I don't have any debt. You know what I'm saying? I don't like the feeling of owing somebody. You know what I'm saying? So I own my own car. The only thing I really don't, you know, own is is my apartment because, you know, I, I don't own an apartment complex. But either way, I can just imagine the burden that people have when they have ten thousand twenty thousand dollars worth of debt and that follows them you can't just like stiff arm them like you could do other people and it just goes to the collectors you know what i'm saying like that will haunt you for the rest of your life and god forbid that you don't follow up in whatever studies that you decided to take going to college because then you just have a debt that's just just saying hey brother you owe us you know what i'm saying and if joe biden at least fulfilled that. Okay, he he stiffed arm us with everything else. You know, he gave us crumbs. You know what I'm saying? I mean, he passed over $700 billion to the military, but he's given us crumbs. You know what I'm saying? If he was to able to fulfill at least this one, because over 60% of people who have student loan debt want their debt to go away, or at least $10,000 worth. And if he almost gets us there, I can guarantee you, Mr. Joe Biden, you will almost get a second term. 